guys now we're going to start the second half if you remember in the last video I did uh, I made a uh, apple pie filling so now we're going to use one box of a yellow cake mix got my little spatula here and to that we're going to add three eggs one cup of oil one cup of apple juice then we're going to give that a good mix Now we're going to check the bottom and make sure there's no dry powder in it. Alright, then I got a metal baking pan here. Alright, so now I got the mixer and all that out of the way. Now, first thing I'm going to do is put a very light layer of the cake mixture in the bottom of this pan. Just make sure you get every corner. Because you don't want your apple sitting right on the bottom. Alright, next, this is the apples that I cooked in the last video. And then we're going to put a layer of apples in there. You don't want it real thick, but you don't want it real thin. So what I do is I usually try to start in the corners and along the edge and just kind of let it self-level. All right. I'm gonna take the rest of our batter and we're just gonna kind of put it on the top. Always remember What's, or uh, think about what size pan you got because remember how high your cake will rise. Now I'm just going to take this and kind of bounce it around. That'll help level it out. Plus, it will help get the bubbles out of it. Now, I've got my oven set at 350, and we're going to put this in the oven for about 25 minutes, and then we'll come back and check it. All right, guys, there it is. Apple pie cake. Now, the best way to serve this you got to let it get all the way cold. I mean, you can have it while it's hot if you want, but I prefer it all the way cold. And then you slice it into squares, and this goes on top of your ice cream. Not your ice cream goes on top of this. Especially if you're going to have it hot. If you're going to have it hot, put this on top of the ice cream. You can have any flavor of ice cream that you want, but I prefer country vanilla ice cream. Oh my gosh, it is so good. I've tried plain vanilla and a couple of others, but I find the country vanilla ice cream is the best. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this, and I'm going to do a few more really quick recipes until Thanksgiving Day because it's just stuff that I'm trying to get out of my way for my Thanksgiving dinner. I hope you guys are enjoying this.